Yeah. Right folk, Alex Jack Lowman G still at the key of uh, security and arms exhibition. At the moment I have a 12 gauge shell suppressor in my hand, mounted to a Mossack 500, I guess. Yep. And um, it is not the salvo. It doesn't even look close to the salvo. The system is a different. Um, what I like about this particular sound suppressor, uh, at first, is its design. I mean, the design looks just awesome, it looks great. And uh, the second thing is, okay, well, that's not exclusive, but just first of all, safety check it. Of course, it's empty. Well, better be safe than, better than be sorry. Okay, so we have right here a ring, an adapter, just like on the salvo that you can put on any shotgun you like. And if you take a look inside there, we see that there is a tube inside there. I'm not sure if you guys can see it. There's a tube inside there with all sorts of holes. And these exhaust holes lead to uh, three different chambers inside here. Um, one downside is you cannot uh, make it shorter or longer. But, uh, I mean, this is 130 piece. I have it in my hands. It is one block. This with four extremely sturdy screws inside a sturdy tube with exhaust holes. I guess I could, this this thing can take a lot of punishment, I guess. Um, the price over here in Ukraine for, for uh, such sound suppressor will be around 7,000 gryvens plus 1,500 for the adapter. And it's 8,500 gryvens that adds up for approximately 250 up to $300. Little less than $300. And that's basically a price you cannot beat. I hope this, the, the guys will export them to the US or at least to the European Union because I think these things will be, uh, they, they will go away like hot sausages. <laughs>